Monza is the enduring home of Ferrari's passionate superfans, the Tifosi, who have supported the mark through thick and thin. And they were duly rewarded in 2024 after the Prancing Horse played a strategic masterstroke that enabled Charles Leclerc to win the milestone 75th Italian Grand Prix five years to the day since his first. With the one-stopping Monegasque stretching his tires to defeat the storming McLarens on the conventional two. Leclerc finished just over 2.6 seconds ahead of McLaren's Oscar Piastri, who had led up until lap 38 of 53, with the Scuderia foiling the Australian's designs on a dominant win. Which more than made up for its failed bid to protect against Lando Norris's opening stop undercut. What an incredible feeling, said a jubilant Leclerc. The first time I won in Monza in 2019 was so emotional to both me and to our whole team. I didn't think that winning here could ever feel like that again, but today it did. For the beaten McLarens, Monza was paused for thought, with Ferrari able to outfox its pace, while Piastri's brutal pass on his teammate Paul Sitter Lando Norris for the lead at the second chicane will no doubt force the mark to confront its new papaya rules of engagement. Given the driver's title is still in contention with eight rounds to go, though it's yet to line up behind Norris beyond press statements. Mercedes didn't have the pace to fight at Monza, with George Russell's race compromised at Turn 1, where he locked up to avoid Piastri and picked up front wing damage. With the Brit coming home seventh, two spots in almost 17 seconds behind teammate Lewis Hamilton, who said he kept up with signs ahead but couldn't do the longer stint or one stop. For Red Bull, Monza was a wake-up call, with reigning world champion Max Verstappen sixth at the flag and understandably downbeat, despite his teammate Sergio Perez just two places behind in eighth. At the moment, both championships are not realistic, he said. Alex Albon scooped Williams its first point since Silverstone for its third score in 2024, all ninth placings. Haas's Kevin Magnussen completed the top 10 for his first point since Austria. But the Dane will be absent in Baku after he earned two penalty points, taking him to 12, meaning a mandatory one-race ban following contact with Alpine's Pierre Gasly during a botched passing attempt. To the driver's standings, and Verstappen still has a 62-point lead over Norris, who set the fastest lap for the bonus point. Leclerc retains third ahead of Piastri, 20 points the gap. Onto the constructors, and McLaren is just eight points behind Red Bull, with eight rounds remaining. Ferrari is 31 points adrift of the Papaya team. Haas is slowly catching RB. Thanks for watching. To stay up to speed on all things Formula One, make sure you hit the subscribe button.